Hello and welcome to another video from the PS Trophy Girl. And on today's video, the trophy we will be collecting is called Launch Day. And the requirements for this is we need to jump off every supercharge ramp in three times. So for us to achieve this, we need to head to the Beast Maker's world and the level that we need to go on to is called treetops and what we're going to be doing is we're going to achieve this trophy launch date and we are also going to 100% complete the level the reason for this is there is a area around the back quite high towards the end where there's a dragon uh, an egg I don't think it's an egg, sorry, I think it's gems. Uh, they're actually quite difficult to get to. Sort of a funky little ramp. Another ramp. And another ramp that you have to take to sort of get over there. So let's crack on with this and start earning these gems. There's a load of these little monkeys throwing bananas at us. These big, big monkeys. Kill these, wipe them out, get their gems. A chest there that needs a key, which we will get to. I'll show you where the key is. But this is our first dragon. And this is Isaac. Spyro, if you jump at the end of a supercharge ramp, you can really go far. I'm all over it. We sure are. So this is our first supercharged ramp. We just want to charge down here, jump across, and take out that chest. And that is also our first ramp completed. So that's towards and in that trophy. Let's just carry on collecting these gems. Get up these monkeys. And drop people in the head. There's a line there. So when we kill this monkey, we make our way up to here. This is in fact our second supercharged ramp. We just want to run down this, jump towards the end. And this is actually where the exit to return for the home is. Bear that in mind. So that's two of the supercharged ramps completed. Collect our gem. We can carry on. So you may have noticed there is an area just above where we landed. Uh, it is actually not possible to hit it from this ramp. There is a guy up there, one of the little thieves. Uh, there's a load of gems that we need to get to. Uh, however, you can't actually get there with the one ramp. So what we need to do is we need to take multiple speed ramps. Uh, and it's sort of a funky way of doing it, which we will soon get to. But now let's carry on collecting our gems. So it can be a bit tricky sort of joining up the ramps. Uh, there's a bit of a pattern with some of them. What you do is you need to get more of a boost. Going down one ramp isn't enough so when you supercharge down multiple ramps and picks up more speed. So we make our way back to this part. When where we need to go is we need, just need to fly over to this ramp where we can continue and progress collecting our gems. Let's head up this part. So instead of go, carrying on up the up the tree, we're going to go straight through this window. It's going to take us this way round. Um, continue collecting these gems, and there is going to be the key for that locked chest that we found earlier. So we keep hold of that, and then when we head up here, more gems, couple more chests. So 
dodge the monkeys. Then once we've collected all them, we just want to glide over to this part, which is our second dragon, which is Lyle. Feeding Spiral, for an amazing tour to treetops. Don't just stop at one supercharge. Ha! Ah. And there's our hint. Like we said, we're going to be taking multiple supercharges. Well, we get us greater distance. So you may notice there is another supercharged ramp here, which is our third one, which we will be taking shortly. We'll take us over to this side. That's three of them, three of the super ramp, supercharged ramps completed for our trophy. We're going to carry on collecting the gems. You may notice over there, so that is the little island that we need to somehow get across to, which has a funky route to get over there, but we will worry about that soon. But this is our trophy. So that is the fourth supercharged ramp we've completed, and that has achieved launch date trophy. There you have it, that is our trophy achieved. What we will do now is we will continue the level and we will earn the rest of the gems. So the next part's a little bit boring. I just spent a bit of the time trying to plan the route I'm going to check out which ramps we need to go down, which ones we need to follow. So I have sped this up a little bit. Don't worry, it's not your video going funny. I just speeded it up so we don't have to watch all this boring footage of me just having a little look around. So I did fly across to the middle to open the locked chest the gems from that one um, and then it was just a case of again running around trying to locate which ramps we take trying to get the correct path to the end so once we eventually found where we're going what we need to do is we need to head to this middle part where that locked chest was and our first ramp is going to be this one. So we take it down, we we'll jump to the right. We want to keep running up this one and follow it through. And then jump to the right again. This will take you to the top of here. There you have it. So this is the top area. Again, you need to supercharge down two of the ramps. Give you that extra speed. Jump a bit further. So we're just gonna crack on and collect these gems to avoid doing this multiple times and possibly missing the jumps and dying loads of times. We're just gonna make sure we get all of our gems. So let's begin our journey back to the top. Oh, right, okay, yeah. You can't go through the whirlwind unless you're near the bottom of it. <laughs> That's a waste of a life. And now it's spawned me up here. Not sure. If I can get back to the top of here. I don't think I can. Okay, so let's make our way back to where we need to be. Yeah, so we've only got 90 gems and we've got that third dragon that we need to get. Which 
is at the top near the end. Yeah, I'm not sure why I've gone this way. I didn't need to come this way. Got that check in in revenge. But let's make our way to the very top. Let's take across here again. Following it up. all the way up to this part and this is where we need to start for this epic journey so when you go down this one we need to make it to the right which is the second supercharged jump which we can't make from here so I'm not sure why I tried doing that what we're going to do is we're going to head down this one straight to the middle follow it to the right down the next supercharged which we don't we need to fly over to the right onto this ramp and then it takes us to the very end just like that so again it might take it may take a few goes to get that right you might lose a few lives but there we have it so that is all of our gems completed Let's just have a chat with the last dragon, Jed. That was quite a ride, Spyro. You learned a lot since you were a young glider. Yeah, well, you could have found an easier spot to get stuck. Yeah, you definitely could have found an easier spot. And that is 100% level complete. Well, I hope you've enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you at the next one. Goodbye! <laughs> Let's <laughs> go.